Let's go. Welcome to the 221st episode of Dan Geesing Plays. Mike, if we last left off, we talked about the Dark 18 episodes where I thought we might have put an end to uh, the portal, but we put ourselves in position here to chuck the next Eye of the Ender. Let's do that for the next, the next I'd say, three episodes are going to be a little short unless we find the portal, but with each short episode, we are going to chuck an eye to keep things moving here, so let's go ahead and chuck it. And it went down. It's floating there. What is there? We're at Y31, we'll call it. It's 636. We keep coming back to this. So let's go ahead. We'll, we'll say it stayed there. And that's what we're going to use. Okay. That's our next marker. We need that eye. Don't disappear on us, eye. All right, so I think progression is being made at least through this. So it's at this level, one would imagine. I feel like we're, sometimes we run in circles here. Though. But someone did say that we're like, from where we started, it was 40 blocks away. So it was hovering here. So let's say it's going to be at Y31. And then from there, let's, uh, let's hover here, though. Should we chuck another? Or do we keep digging? No, you roll. And remember, we closed off this area because we th thought we were getting lost here. So let's let's stay at Y31, and then the next area we chuck in is going to be here, th through that next beacon of hope. Let's dig a little. We're going to go diagonal here. See if we can't. See, I feel like we need to go two for one here, though. So we chuck it while standing here. Let's at least give ourselves a little clearance up top. Whoa. So that if it does go up, we can at least see it a little more. So let's knock the roof off this. And then we'll see. We're getting a little... Uh, I don't think it's going to be up there. Let's check, though. Nah, because we've already excavated that. Whoa. Eat up, sir. Um, is that a mini? A mini Cooper. That's not a mini Cooper. All right, so we just kind of lost where we were excavating here. Let's go back to the Beacon of Hope. Beacon of Hope, where are you? Can we pick up that sign? We cannot. How about we start labeling? There's the beacon. So we'll call this what? Beacon. We'll call this Beacon A. Beak. That's not how you spell Beacon. Beacon A Crispy. Why? Okay, so that means we're. We think we're at the right Y level, but we don't know about the right X level. So let's clear out the, let's clear this area out, get a little excavation area here, and we'll see what happens. We gotta be close, man. Ha. I wonder what that we gotta be close counter would be at, in terms of where we're at. All right, enough of that. We're, we're chucking another one. Please just don't go behind us. It's floating right here. So what does that even mean? If it's floating right here, that means it's got to be up or down. Right? Beacon. Non-crispy. This is the spot. So if this is the spot, it's either up or down. Right? I mean, it's the confusion. This is the, it was floating right here. So does that mean it's on the X level or it's on the Y level? Which I just did that oppositely. So if it's floating here, does it, does it float above or below the actual area? And now we got some issues here. Is that huh. 
Huh. I know you guys are screaming Dan Dig, but I feel like we've already dug down. So... I don't know, man. So it's not down. It's not up. This is the Y. It's at Y28. You can bet your face on that. So let's dig across. Why would it hover right there, though? That's what I don't get. That's that nub life. I almost feel like Googling it right now. Matter of fact, that's exactly what we're going to do. So you guys know that we're making some real-life progression. I'm. This is what I'm doing. I am... I should probably just show you guys this, too. Um, I'm going to Google... This is how desperate, just so you guys know, this is the desperation. I of Ender. I of Ender, I'm going to read this. Um, when right click, the eye of the Ender will fly in the direction of the nearest Ender portal, traveling through any blocks necessary, and will leave a trail of purple, purple particles in its wake. A thrown eye will lead to a stronghold, but not exactly to an end portal frame while far away from the end portal the eye travels upward to offer an easily visible indication of the horizontal direction the player must travel when the player gets close to the ender portal's horizontal horizontal coordinates the eye floats in a more precise direction that takes the y axis into account this means the often the eye will travel downwards to indicate the player is above a portal and must mine downwards. So if this is the golden area and we have to mine downwards, I mean, all right, we got to do what we got to do. So if, the, if this is where we need to go, this is where we need to go. So let's go ahead and let's get this set up. Throw that garbage down there. And we'll see what the deal is. Oh, God. So, someone's throwing stuff at us. Don't die. Do not die. I can't handle any die here. Poison and slowness. 22 seconds. Is this the end? No. No. Seven. Come on, heart. Oh. Oh, wow. We got extremely lucky there. So lucky. Extremely lucky. Sorry, that was an emergency. All right, let's do this. Um. Let's just count our blessings before they hatch here. What the heck? I don't even know what to do here. Let's um Let's keep in mind where the heck we are right now. So I feel like we've gotten a little Okay, so I just want to it floats here, so that's going to be X, six, it's like whatever this is, we're going down. Um, let's go ahead and make our elevator. All right, we're going down here, sir. Let's mark it. This is the up elevator here, just so we know. Elevator up. And this is the block that we're just, we're digging straight down. That's not right. It is not right. I'm about to rage quit here. We're about to die here too. Let's be careful. The rage is real. Like, I feel like in this, through this entire series, we've, we've managed to keep a cool head for the most part. But now it's just like this game's just toying with us. And I can't handle it. Like, you got to keep in mind, right now, the other playthrough on the channel is Dark Souls 2. And for as tough as that game is, 
I'm okay with it because it's, it doesn't mislead you like this game. So we're just going to throw another pearl. And it better lead us where to go. Wow. Dead. I freaking hate this game. I hate it. This is like, this isn't acting. This is like real life anger. Like, like if we would have fell there, I probably would have deleted the world. Just joking. I wouldn't have done that, but. I mean, we're just taking shots to the face. Why wouldn't we? Just take it. At this point, Minecraft is rubbing our face in it. And saying, you know what? Here, save this. Save ourselves. Clear some of this garbage out. You know what? I literally, I don't know if I can offer any more to this world. <laughs> God. What has our life become? Endlessly looking for something that doesn't even exist. And it just went up. Went up this way. So we'll say up, crispy, up. I don't even care. I mean, like, they want to take our, our freedom. You take our freedom. But see, here's the deal. Why would that float right there? I freaking don't even get it. If, if anyone, I, I guess this is the episode in which we need some encouragement. Because I'm a generally positive individual. And we're going to stay positive here. This is not working for us right now. The phone's blowing up. Getting trolled by freaking witches here. The only thing that could soften the blow as if we were to find it behind one of these walls right here or a little minecraft music takes the edge off that's gonna guess there's more water up there all right sirs i gotta wrap it up here I, i'm on the borderline of deleting the entire world. I'll see you guys next time.